Yo, what's up, train riders? Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Scrapping Hunter Tinker Fun. This is my first time, and I guess last time, on the Premier Train. Over the years, these guys have done a fantastic job putting together a collaboration of channels setting it up i think it's five years now the mad stacker started it and the mad stacker i believe is going to end it now i had a film set up for y'all walking down the train tracks at a train station and a whole thing and unboxing some stuff from the pirate stacker and from sherry ward and well in classic scrapping fashion it didn't work out and here I am at 9 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday trying to get this on the train to nowhere. So I've got no one to talk to except for you folks that are watching this thing. I would like to say congratulations to Mad Stacker for all his hard work, for what he's accomplished. I'd like to say congratulations to Will's Treasures for hanging on all the time. Uh, I know John Wolf was included in the in the train we've got big red boy in on the train right now which i believe at one time he was on the train as redneck stacker or um well so many names so many channels and that's only like three i'm really off the cuff i'm at work right now so um i hope that the 12 minutes here isn't gonna bore the life out of you i really don't even have anything to show you i don't even really have anything to talk about and i'm only two minutes in usually my channel uh, I talked to the chat, but there's no chat today. You guys are going to just watch this little blurb of me and laugh and say, this guy, he got nothing. I don't even have a coin to show you. I don't even have a coin that has no numismatic value to show you. No precious metals, nothing. Literally, corrupt file, didn't work, couldn't put it on the train, but I wanted to make it an appearance and a presence. Um, I'm sitting out here getting sandwiches for my crew what's new with me you may ask where has scrapping been he's been gone for quite some time hasn't he yep well scrapping has acquired a a uh, contracting company and has been working probably 14 hours a day like crazy um misses everyone in the community dearly and if you're new to the community welcome to the community we need new people to add more energy into the community um, the precious metals uh, is up as everyone knows gold is it's it's reached all-time highs over $2,500 an ounce that seems to be you know where a lot of people have directed themselves it's still high for all of us um, silver stackers that's where we all started at least on YouTube kind of got delved into that I think we started when it was like I don't know 19 or $17 an ounce and it's it's up there uh, last I checked, I think $29 an ounce. It goes up and down, fluctuates. Not nearly uh, following gold like you would think it would. The markets are all crazy. The world's all crazy. There's a big shift in power. You know, we're all, um, you know, in the ride together. On this crazy train, if you will. I think that the future is going to have a lot more ups and downs. I think everyone's uh, hinging on the upcoming presidential election. But we don't need to get po political here, you know what I mean? Even though it kind of ties into what we do. You know, on my channel, uh, I did do um, metal pouring and tinkering around with electronic e-waste and stuff like that. Which, eventually I'll do more of that. Now I have a shop, so I might be able to take you into that at some point. We could scrap some wire. Electrical contractor, by the way. That's right. Um, I look forward to seeing you guys in person again. Maybe we can do the Tulsa uh, event if that's happening. Yep, that's right. If you're watching this on the Premier Train, all of us YouTubers got together out in Tulsa, Oklahoma uh, for, a, for a show. So you can come out and see that. Stay tuned to all these channels. There's a whole list of them. Unfortunately, I don't have the list in front of me, but watch the next one and the next one and the next one. Get to know these channels. They're... Uh, they're working hard to put this content out for you. 
much harder than I, I have been recently uh, here on YouTube for sure. These guys study up. They they do what they need to do to, to bring you more than just a, a chat. You know, I'm a vlog kind of style. Um, show some things off. You can watch my past videos. All my live streams are, are, are up. I look forward to getting off this train at some point. But maybe uh, someone else will become the new conductor. Maybe start a new premiere train. Maybe Saturdays won't be so empty. Maybe all these channels will just continue on. Not necessarily a premiere train, but it's hard. It's hard work to put out a video every week, every day. Whatever, whatever you're trying to do with your algorithm, whatever you're trying to do with your channel. Content is a lot harder than you, you would think it is. So, my hat is definitely off. Uh, my hat's off to all these guys that have been on here consistently every Saturday. Lined it up. Put it together. Made sure they had the timing. Had everything that needed to be done. Got it in. Did the work. Congratulations, guys. To me, this is, is not a goodbye. This is a next steps. You know, younger channels can, they'll come up with newer ideas. You know, we had plenty of ideas come out of my channel. The Easter egg hunts and stuff like that. You know, you could you can check back five years ago and see, oh, look, I did it. And then other people did the same thing. You know what I mean? And channels like Spectacular, even an older channel, did something. And it's been copied many times. So will you be the next idea guy? I hope you will. I hope that the premiere train thing strikes an idea in your head after watching. Go, hmm, what could I do with all these channels and, and make that make something else new? What could I do a collaboration? Could we do a boomerang box? I haven't seen one of those in years. Unless they're out there and I'm just, you know, that distant, which is possible. But not really. I mean, I've only been going about five months. So hopefully uh, we'll have some content in the future. Things are just crazy trying to get everything organized. It takes a lot of mental capacity to put on a one hour, two hour live stream. And that's what my channel is, live streams. Um, it takes a lot though to put together a 15 minute video that's coherent, that puts something educational together for someone that shows off something other than unboxings. But even unboxings take power mental fortitude to accomplish and get done so my hats off to all you guys seriously the hard work shows and congratulations on uh, uh, where you've gone and good luck to where you will be in the future I hope you have continued success and anyone watching the premiere train now takes some bits of knowledge and and uh, runs with it too. You know what I mean? Copying something is, is just flattery to me. Um, it, it's This is about uh, the passion of, of precious metals, coins, scrapping. Uh, it's all kind of blended in together. Uh, prospecting, you know what I mean? It's all around that metal, right? Whether it's aluminum or copper, gold, platinum, palladium, it doesn't matter. It's not about the size of your pocketbook. It's about the about the camaraderie and the fun, you know? At least it has always been for me. I've got about four minutes left, and I don't really know what else to say. Like I said, I was walking down the train tracks, reminiscing, uh, and then the files corrupt. So, 12 minutes of me, of you staring at me, of course, I'm staring at the camera off the side because the camera's right here, and I was looking over here because I'm looking at myself speak, which is very odd, too. I know that we've uh, had a couple of these live stream type deals where um, last minute, this is what happens. You get out of touch with what you need to say, what you're trying to convey, and then you start looking at the timer, and the time is running down and down. And you're just trying to make filler. My favorite one was from John Wolf. God bless him. But he did it. He did it. He pulled it off, right? He made it all the way through the video. 
and we got some nuggets of information from John, good old John Prospector. And uh, that's what the premiere train's about, man. All different types of people, all different styles of filming, vlogging, craziness. Like with Pistol Pack and Pilot, you never know what he's going to put up. And you can still watch his channel. Wild West Stacker. Stacks and stuff. He did, did a lot of live streams. I think he had to back out of this train. Because it's tough, right? If you don't have the time, like I'm at work. And um, you got to get the live stream in. And if you can't, you can't. My biggest uh, regret is disappointing my audience. You know, for a long time, I used to to push hard and make sure I was still on because, you know, it becomes like a thing, like a, almost like a therapy or, um, you know, hey, it's uh, Monday night. Let's go hang out. But this is the way we hang out. We don't leave our homes. We're all in different places. I've vlogged from all over the East Coast and had people hang out with me from the West Coast. So... Find your niche. And maybe you too could be a car on the train, the next train, a future train. Or maybe you'll come up with something new. I don't know. New trends all the time. New platforms. But we like it here on YouTube. It makes it easy. You know what I'm saying? Well, I think that the uh, rail station is coming up here. And I'm going to have to disembark I've got about 12 minutes in and I think that should do it so I wish you all well and if I had the list in front of me I would tell you who's up next so just uh, pay attention and check them out hopefully the redirects work hopefully someone can help this guy <laughs> alright I gotta go sandwiches are calling later